Why do they keep putting me in video games without paying me, man? <laughs> this nigga is me! <laughs> oh, man. Look at that, we're twins! You get the bag and fumble it, I get the bag and flip it and tumble it. Good morning, gamers! It's your man, Just Jay Sama. So today, we are actually watching and reacting to Sony's State of Play. Um, I know it's a few days late, it's a few days old, but... I mean, there was really only, like, four, maybe five things for me to actually enjoy, so... Uh, yeah, let's just go ahead and peep. We're just gonna go ahead and peep this and see see what's hot, see what's not. You know what I'm saying? A little bit of PS5 action at the beginning. Now, um, from what I remember, I think there's a lot of stuff on VR. So, I'm very excited about that. VR is, is something that I haven't really had a chance to dabble in a whole lot because I don't have a VR for my PlayStation. Um, but apparently they're on VR 2 now, so, okay, I guess. So I originally thought this was The Last of Us. I thought we were getting factions. I legitimately thought we were getting factions finally for The Last of Us 2, but, um, turns out that was a lie. Which is dope. I'm very excited for a Resident Evil 4 remake. Hold on, let me make sure this, this quality is turned up to 1080. We need to see the crispness. The crispness on uh, Leon's face. Now, I'm not gonna lie. Resident Evil 4 was a fun game to play. And I think it was the game that got me... I think it was the, the one Resident Evil game that got me into the series. I'm not gonna lie. Running around this town, shooting up all these people is gonna be kind of crazy. There's just some gruesome stuff in the Resident Evil series, man. And I'm, I'm not... I don't know. I've, there's just been a lot of stuff when it comes to Resident Evil that I'm just like, do they have to put that in the game? Like, when you're going through Resident Evil, um, which one is that? When you're going through Biohazard, which is Resident Evil 7, and you just see, like, the this entire kitchen filled with, like, guts and body parts and stuff that they've been eating, and it's just like, ugh, why would you do this? Like, why would you want, ugh, nah. So... Uh, luckily, I've gotten a chance to play multiple remakes. I haven't finished uh, Resident Evil 2 yet. I finished Resident Evil 3. Um, 7 and 8, of course. Uh, amazing, amazing games. I love 7 and 8. They're so much fun. 8 specifically. I'm hyped to see a Resident Evil 4. I want to see a Resident Evil 5 remake because I think that game needs to be done some, some justice, all right? Resident Evil 5 was the game that got me uh, to really, like, enjoy resident evil just because you could do all the all the clown cartoony stuff after you beat the game i wonder if they're gonna go with the fixed camera like they did in resident evil 4 i wonder if they're gonna keep that the same or am i gonna be able to spin it around now now let's take a look at her. now when i saw this i i was like this is the most wild shit okay this is this is this right here you want to put me in VR with this lady with <laughs> what well, Ethan, what is going on ain't no way bro see how special you I'm not about to get strung up by this big bitch this is truly like some of this stuff in this game is truly terrifying and to do it in VR you have to be an actual crazy person like all oh, my legs <laughs> this right here unhand me woman <laughs> unhand me Although some of this is kind of hot. I'm not gonna lie. And I don't mean, look at the, bruh. Where he tosses the gun from one hand to the other. Hello? That's kind of hot. Yeah, but the rest of this, the rest of this I'm not okay with. Now, I want to know if I can play this with my controller. Not only that, the other question I have is, am I going to be able to use my same save file? Because if I can, oh, I'm, I'm running through these mofos infinite ammo. Bam, 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 bam. I'm excited for it, man. I'm excited. VR actually might be something I, I have to invest in. Matter of fact, hold on. Let me see something. How much is a how much is a PlayStation VR? 150 bucks. 250 if you want game bundles. Comes with like the little wands and stuff like that. Some some ridiculous person is selling a bundle for $520 on Amazon. Like, are you crazy? Alright. That's neat. That's neat. I just wanted reference. Of all people. Have the audacity to question I don't me. remember what this is. I think this is like a new... You 
Zombie game. From the putrid waters of yeah, this one's a new zombie game. To plunder I thought this was Dying Light. I was, I'm not gonna lie. I thought this was a Dying Light update, and I was like, this is gonna be crazy. What have you but. done to ensure the future of this forsaken city? I'm not gonna lie. These VR games looking hot, man. They're looking good. VR has come a very, very long way. And this game got parkour in it and shit. It was wow. I wow. Who did it. it was I who shined as a beacon of hope for all. The tower cries out for blood. And Ooh. I vow to spill it. Okay. It's giving she's giving She's giving buzz. She's giving buzz from Far Cry for sure. Retribution. Walking Dead has not made good games in a while. So I don't know about this one. I don't I don't know if this is a train I want to ride, boys. I don't know. Welcome home. Let me see. I think they have a couple more. Yeah, they kind of have a couple more VR games. I mean, this is cool. This is cool. I thought this was Star Citizen finally coming to PlayStation and I was like, "Wow, like this is this is crazy." But I think this is No Man's Sky. Yeah, it's No Man's Sky. I mean, it looks good, but this doesn't... They're really putting a lot of effort into this game that's come out, what, four years ago? I don't... I don't know, man. I don't know. I'm really excited to finally play the a working version of this game for the first time. But it's been so long. It's like, don't charge me $60 for a game that's like, just now started getting good. You know what I mean? That's like paying $60 for Destiny. It's like, what? Why would I do that? And now this, this I'm not really hyped for. I'm not gonna lie. A Horizon a VR game? It's, it's probably gonna be crazy, but... I didn't even finish the main game. Guys, guys, I didn't even... I didn't even finish the main game. I... I don't want this. <laughs> it looks dope. It looks fire. Like, the graphics are going to be amazing. It's going to be phenomenal in VR. But I didn't even finish the main fucking game. How do you expect me? No! I stopped playing this game for Elden Ring. <laughs> Hell nah. We're not going to make it. Yeah, this shit going to be crazy. Blameless Murad had me released from prison, but why? Redemption when does this take place? Has. Like, during the second game, or...? Climb the mountain. Because you're not playing as Aloy. Find out why the machines are attacking. Yo, the bow and arrow is going to be crazy in this game. Here's the, here's the thing about VR. When you're playing a game like this, this game is gonna require so much like actual like real-time hand-eye coordination. Playing in these, v in these VR games, it's tough because the game has to slow down for you to have a reaction time. Like, like even this part right here. You see what I mean? Like you have to see that stuff coming and if it's in real time, like VR is not gonna allow for that. So there's probably going to be like moments just before you get hit where the game has to slow down so you have time to react. But that's just that's just my opinion. What do I know? Skills and courage. See? Like right there. Your skills. Like right here, like it's full motion, like you're going like and courage. A certain amount of speed and then all of a sudden when you're supposed to react, the game slows down. So it's like uh that can kind of kill gameplay a little bit. You have walked in the shadows, Reyes. Now it is time to climb into the light. Coming exclusively Hi. to PlayStation I'm VR 2. Of the mountain. Coming update to Horizon Forbidden West, including New Game Plus. <laughs> I don't even want to react to this. I'm just... This part right here, a major update to Forbidden West. Performance mode. Okay. 
<laughs> Switch outfits. <laughs> you can reset. I, I, yo, this is the part that killed me right here. Hold on. When I saw this, you can redistribute your skill points. You can respec in the in the updated version of this game. Why was and I'm glad I didn't even play more of this game because for me to like put stuff into a skill tree and then I couldn't even respec unless I restart the whole game. Come on, bro. That sounds like a very basic feature. Why is that an update? Ultra hard difficulty. Why is that an update? And then this one kills me. This one kills me. New Game Plus is a feature add-on that you had to put on later. Shh. Can I get some L's in the chat? Can I get some L's in the chat? Video games really just have not been... This is why I didn't want to react to the state of play. I knew I was going to be extremely negative towards this. But like, come on now. I need, I need big L's in the chat. Because this is... This just seems like a feature that should have been in the game in the first place. I'm not complaining because it's a great game. It's a great experience. Horizon was fun to play for the nine hours that I played it and then dropped it. It was just giving very much like this game is not where it should be. And these are perfect examples. Like there's probably multiple things within the game that I didn't even make it to. That it's like, oh, okay, cool, I guess. So... So Miles Morales is coming out this fall, and then uh, Spider-Man is coming out at the end of summer. So, I mean, if you guys care about the cat game, I mean, this looks kind of this looks kind of cool. This looks like it's gonna be fun to play. I'll probably buy it uh, when it's like on sale. I think the game goes for forty dollars. I think on Steam it's thirty, but I mean on PS5 everything is ten dollars more expensive. So. You know, we'll see. The parkour is kind of crazy. The fact that you're playing a, a kitty cat stealth game. Bro, that's kind of hot. <laughs> it's like you're playing a Metal Gear Splinter Cell. Yeah, this seems dope. I'm excited to play this. This is definitely something I would want to play in VR. Not only that, the main cat's really adorable, so I kind of, I kind of have to get it. Comes out July 19th. I think it's going to be free on the PlayStation Plus store. So if you have like one of the higher, one of the higher tiers. All right. Now this, this right here, this got me super excited because me and the boys were in the chat and we were like, yo, this is dead space. This is clearly Dead Space. It's made by the same studio, the same production team. I think even the same writers as Dead Space. This is actually the successor to Dead Space. You gotta let that go. Because your new life is entirely in my hands. I'm just trying to give you a chance. That rebirth. This shit looks crazy. I'm not gonna lie. Ugh, nigga. Oh my god. <laughs> hey yo. This game looks fire, man. Oh, I'm about to put this on extra hard difficulty and just not be able to finish the game, man. This is going to be so much fun. I just love that last part. Ugh. Gives me chills every time. Damn! <laughs> Whoa! Yeah, the Callisto project or protocol? This is not coming out until December. I am so, f I'm so mad. I'm so mad. I want this now. I need this now. This game looks great. I can't wait to turn the difficulty up and then cry playing this game. <laughs> Street Fighter, I can skip that too. I don't really, the game looks great, but it's not really something I'm interested in. We can skip past the indie games. I'm, I'm really not buying it. They put me in another video game, guys. Look at this. Why do they keep putting me in video games without paying me, man? This nigga is me! 
Oh, man. Look at that. We're twins. This is me. Literally, he's even got the same. He's even got the same facial. Oh, my God. He got the same facial hair as me, man. Come on. Of course, Final Fantasy 16, which I'm not going to lie. I was not excited about. But now that I know Forspoken's not getting pushed. Oh, the dog. Very excited. It wears away at our very being. It breaks us. It unmakes us. At its immaculate aspect. This shit looks the great. Itself. The icon. I cannot wait to play this, man. Isn't there? Every day we delay brings us closer to disaster. This shit right here. They better not, yo. This like gameplay portion right here, I I can I can tell this is a cutscene during a boss battle, but they better not change any aspects of that. I hope the game plays like this. Like this looks beautiful. Look at this! Look at the sauce! I'm very excited for this. Look at the combo moves, man. Although, I will say a lot of this, like, spinny, twirly combat and stuff like that, like, it looks great, but it doesn't have the same hit that something like Devil May Cry has. Like, Devil May Cry combo system is just amazing because every single hit, like, basically shakes the screen and it, like, makes it seem like it's way more impactful. Are they about to have sexual intercourse in this game, guys? Hold up! Hold up! The new order to see us Wait a minute now. Yeah, this shit looks crazy, man. Our duels shake the island to its foundations. Now, I'm I may be wrong about this. Let me turn this down a little bit. I may be wrong about this. But I believe this is going to be the origin story of the summons. I think. Only because there's a huge emphasis on the summons. I'm not going to lie. I'm trying to see... I'm trying to see the... Th I'm trying to see these uh, summons fight each other, man. This shit about to be crazy. It is true. Yet for every citizen who falls, another can be bred. Every home that burns, another can be built. Bahamut versus Ifrit is about to go crazy. I just noticed the choir is singing the names of the summon. I just noticed that. I, I literally just noticed it. <laughs> that's that's kind of a big deal sephiroth has his own theme song and his name is literally the only lyric in the song so awaken child of fate awaken if free Yeah, this about to be this about to be crazy. This is coming summer of next year, man. I mean, I didn't need to see any gameplay or anything until next year, but this is cool too. This is cool. So and that's a wrap. So that was this year's state of play. Um, I'm not gonna lie, it's kind of it's kind of mid. There's only four or five games I really want. I mean, I'm excited for the whole thing, obviously, because games are games. Uh, but games also being mad expensive for PlayStation Five makes it a little uh. Okay, I guess this is what we do it. Huh? This is what we do it. Okay, cool. So let me know what you guys think down in the comment section below. Uh, what is the game that you guys are most excited for? Um, honestly, um, the game I'm most excited for isn't even in the state of play, but the closest thing is going to be Resident Evil 4. Resident Evil 4, pretty much. Uh, Final Fantasy 16. Those are probably my top two, but you know, we'll have to see. 
uh, a lot of these games are still pretty far away. Uh, the Resident Evil is, I think Resident Evil 4 is coming out next month. So we'll have to hop on that. Maybe we'll play it on stream. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments section. Uh, if you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure to give it a like. I am desperate, 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 desperate for people to like me on the internet. So please give this video a thumbs up when you finally do see it. Um, if you are new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe. I need my subscriptions back. Guys, 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 since the last video, we lost five more subscribers. Um, uh, That's obviously not okay. YouTube is really just trying to like... Just, I don't know what YouTube's trying to do. They're trying to get me up off this platform. They don't want me to have my my subs anymore. So, you know, make sure you guys show some love. So hit the subscribe button. Turn on the notifications so that way you can get notified every single time there's a new video. Uh, but with that being said, this has been your man, Just Jay Sama. And I'll see you guys next time.